Hello and welcome to the sixth annual WCI Film Festival and Lecture Series, an interdisciplinary student and community-centered public humanities program that generates conversations and cultivates relationships across U Albany's campus and our capital district communities. I'm Ray Mulstock, a lecturer in the University at Albany program in writing and critical inquiry and the chair of the film festival. The WCI Film Festival and Lecture Series 2021 event will run from October 21st through 24th in the U Albany Campus Center Ballroom. It is free and open to the public. Please be aware that masks must be worn at all times while in University at Albany public buildings. You can find more information about U Albany's public health policies linked below. This year's festival is in partnership with the University at Albany Program in Writing and Critical Inquiry, the University at Albany Office of the Vice Provost and Dean for Undergraduate Education, the University at Albany Libraries, and the American Red Cross of Northeastern New York. We are co-sponsored by the University at Albany Vice President for Research, the New York State Writers Institute, the University at Albany Alumni Association, University at Albany Auxiliary Services, the University at Albany Department of English, the University at Albany Department of Anthropology, the University at Albany Department of Literature, Languages, and Culture, the University at Albany Red Cross Club, the University at Albany Community Service Living and Learning Community, and Humanities New York with support from the National Endowment for the Humanities. You can see the full list of our sponsors in the comments section below. The 2021 festival explores one of the world's most popular and enduring images, the vampire. Its folklore comes to us from almost every continent and has inspired hundreds of films from around the globe, not to mention novels, short stories, plays, video games, TV shows, fine arts, comic books, and more. Because it is so universal, the vampire has provided a powerful metaphor for prescient matters from imperialism to the AIDS pandemic, Black Lives Matter to the Me Too movement, arts and immortality to the death and decay of affect. As Bram Stoker scholar Nina Orbach has said, Every age embraces the vampire that it needs. In this current age of cultural reckoning, resilience, and rebirth, the vampire comes to symbolize our individual and collective trauma and our strength as we rise to meet the new challenges that face us. This year's films include selections from six nations and six decades of production, including classics of cinema history and new ways of interpreting the vampire's ancient and fascinating folklore. Through the trajectory of these films and the introductions and open discussions that will accompany them, the power of the vampire to encapsulate, communicate, and represent the world as it is felt and imagined inspires us to think more deeply about what monsters and heroes might best represent our time, our dreams, and our terrors. You can find the full schedule of events on our website and social media accounts linked below. Although many of them are physically beautiful, please be aware that the behavior of vampires can sometimes be quite hideous. Many of the films you will see this weekend are rated R and with good reason. They might include physical and sexual violence, gore, adult language, and explicit sexual content. Information regarding the individual films can be found on our website, which is linked below in the comments section, and reviews for the films are readily available across the internet. If you or someone you know has been the victim of assault or violence, Help is available 24 seven at the CDPC crisis unit and mobile crisis team. Call 518-549-6500. The number can also be found below in the comment section. This year's incredible keynote guest is author activist, Jewel Gomez. Gomez's stories, novels, poems, plays, and criticisms center on the experiences of LGBTQ plus women of color. Gomez's powerful novel, The Gilda Stories, which is being developed for TV with writer-director Cheryl Dunye as showrunner, follows the life of a Black lesbian vampire, once a runaway slave, from 1850 to 2050. By reimagining American history through the metaphor of vampires and projecting a unique vision of its future, Gomez's Gilda asks questions about family, power, community, and identity, about what it means to be human, even when others don't see you that way, and what it means to take blood, not life and leave something in exchange. The 2021 Vampire Film Festival will benefit the American Red Cross of Northeastern New York. To help them do the amazing work that they do, the WCI Film Festival and Lecture Series, in partnership with the UAlbany Red Cross Club, will host a blood drive on October 22nd from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. in the UAlbany Campus Center, room 116. 
In addition, the Red Cross will be presenting important information about blood at the Interdisciplinary Symposium on October 21st. Members of the University at Albany Red Cross Club will be present throughout the weekend to answer questions and we will provide audience members with donation information. Remember, every drop can preserve a life. So join us in the Campus Center Ballroom from October 21st to 24th for intriguing introductions, fascinating films, and lively discussions. As always, we invite and encourage participation from all of our audience members as we celebrate this year's theme. Thank you from all of us for coming out to support the humanities. Let these films remind us of the importance of the arts, of collaboration, and of coming together as a community. And please enjoy the show. <laughs>